Welcome to Enchanted Tarot. This is for the sign of Cancer for the month of June. It is a general reading. That being said, it may or it may not resonate with you. If it doesn't, check your other placements. Your messages could be there, but if not, then simply check back with me in the following week when I put out new messages for your sign. Okay, so um, this is either your energy or theirs, okay? Um, we have the Seven of Swords, the Five of Discs, and the Four of Wands reversed. So somebody did something here with the Seven of Swords. Um, uh, let me see. Half truths. This can speak to being half true. Uh, um, telling half truths. It can be being sneaky. Um, somebody was doing something in secret and not telling the truth. Um, but uh, whatever it was they were doing came out. I feel they got caught. Um, this caused uh, a crisis here in this in this uh, relationship um, because the Four of Wands is now reversed. So um, there was an upheaval because of what happened and everything now is like up in the air. So um, there's a flux here. There's a lot of insecurities with this five of dis. Um, it could be a, a change in, in status uh, is suspended or hanging in the air. You don't know what where this is going. Um, somebody would be um, acting uh, aloof, uh, being cold, uh, because uh, of what happened here, because of what came out. Blame. There can be blame. The person who got caught is looking back now at what they lost or what they stand potentially to lose. I feel, uh, I mean, this person broke the other person's heart. That's clear. Um, and it could have been uh, through flirting with somebody else. Uh, it was some type of emotional betrayal that caused this um, this loss or potential loss. Again, our Four of Wands down here, that's what's at the root, um, is in the reverse. So this is that, you know, uh, upset, that struggle. Um, whatever is happening here it it is temporary although it won't feel like it in the moment that it's happening it doesn't feel temporary it feels very threatening like it's going to end to the person who did this or who caused this um, by their actions that person w wants to apologize, um, wants to come back, wants that person to take another, uh, like a leap of faith on them. They are apologizing for what they've done uh, or want to. I feel that this may not have yet happened. This is what they want think or are desiring to do. Um, they will be very, uh, how would I say that? They plan to, to kind of woo you, you know, romance you, because that's a card of a romance that's sitting here. And that's what he does. He's the charmer. This is somebody who is very charming, um, typically and uh, very persuasive. 
and that person because that's this is Prince Charming and Prince Charming broke somebody's heart but he is accepting responsibility for his actions he looks back and he sees oh my god what have I done and he he's looking back at what he stands to lose um, or what he has actually lost depending where you are in the energy I think he believes that he can still save this he the situation he's in he recognizes uh, that he caused it okay so he's accepting responsibility for that yeah and so and, and that's what uh, the Milara Mantam here would be telling him this is this this is the consequence of the action you took or the decision you made you want a fair and just outcome here you must own up to it all right and so this is exactly what he's doing so what we see on the mind is um, a reunion and a discussion uh, for a new beginning okay it's still in the idea stages nothing has been planted here in this field okay so giving clarity on a situation uh, on the situation of the three of swords The Three of Swords is a very stormy situation, and that's how it would feel to someone. Um, it was a situation that brought heartbreak to someone um, caused by that Prince Charming. So, but there is recognition on the part of that person for what he's done. These cards are saying the same thing. And they want a new opportunity and they are coming forward and they're coming forward uh, to bring clarity um, hoping to restore the harmony here and to apologize they're coming forward and they're coming forward in uh, uncertainty about how this is going to go if you will accept the cup that they offer if you will accept the apology you see um, they let me see um, they know they have wisdom um, that they did make a bad choice and they're not quite sure uh, if they can uh, get out of the situation or repair the situation that they that they that this uh, previous choice caused or made or created It could have been a short-lived infatuation with someone that caused this problem but there would have been or there there had to have been 
some underlying emotional issues between you for that to happen. Like um, maybe they felt, uh, they felt shut out. I'm just giving you an example, but I'm just saying that there's something that caused them to look elsewhere. It's because there's some part of them that they uh, felt was not being fulfilled. So uh, this is a, a type of conversation you're going to have with that person. There's going to be a discussion, a meeting to discuss. They are uncertain. They don't know how it's going to go, but they desire uh, to fix things. The other person is wounded and will not be trusting so easily. Okay, so um, with that nine of wands, it's like a... Um, relying this is somebody who feels threatened because they've just previously experienced a, a crisis here and uh, so they're relying uh, or not well, not really relying but I mean that past experience where they've been hurt it is just like really fresh on the mind so that's going to make them very guarded as they face this because it would be a, it will be very challenging for them because of that experience to reestablish uh, this bond of trust that you once had you know but I mean it is doable it is doable but it, it, it's something that will take time so anyway, back to this person who's coming in with this new wisdom that's been gained. He has to repair all of this damage he's caused. And he is very much afraid. You know, he's got all of these cups before him. And he's very much afraid uh, because right now they're all empty as he rides towards that meeting. He doesn't know what's going to fill those cups. And so he doesn't know if he's going to be able to get out of this mess that he's created, if he'd be able to restore it and turn that four of wands back upright. I'll leave it upright. I feel that it is possible, but that it is something that it's not going to happen overnight. It's going to take time. That is what I have for you. I thank you for watching, for liking and for sharing my videos and for subscribing. Also, thank you to everyone who has sent in a donation. It is greatly appreciated. Many blessings.